Hi everyone, this is Asma Mishtaq from DEE Vibes and in this video lecture I am going to explain what is the method of least squares. This method is actually used for finding the approximated uh, solutions of the system of the form of AX is equal to B. Here the vector B is actually the vector of the coefficients which can be written as B1, B2. A is the matrix of the coefficients like A11, A12 a21 and a22 while x is a vector having the components x1 and x2 and basically what we do when we solve the system of the linear equations we intend to write b as a linear combination of its column vectors so basically if b lies in the column space of a we see that the system is consistent so x1 times of c1 plus x2 times of c2 should result in b okay this is possible only when b lies in the column space of the matrix a but what about if there this is not possible so let's have an example uh, let's say if a is equal to 1 2 1 3 0 0 and b is equal to 4 5 and 6 in this case this is not possible to find the solution of the system since b doesn't lie in the column space of a now we can find an approximated solution for this particular system by using the method of the least squares which says that if this is certain column C1, this is certain column C2 and this is the column space of this matrix A and B lies somewhere over here. Then what we do, according to the methods of the least squares, we draw the projection from B in on the column space of A. Okay, and we mark it as a x hat, which is actually the projection of b on a. And then what we do, since we, if we will subtract this projection, which is actually this, from the vector b, what we are going to get b minus a x hat will be a vector that will be perpendicular to the column spaces of A now. So if you will take the uh, dot product of it, it will result in 0. Fine. So this equation will be used for finding the method of the least squares and according to which if you simplify this expression, you can see that it becomes A transpose B minus a transpose A into x hat is equal to 0. If you take it on the right hand side you will get A transpose A into x hat and on further simplification x hat will be equal to A transpose A whole inverse into A transpose into B where x is the approximated solution. So let's just apply the method of least squares for finding the solution of this system. First of all, what you have to do, you have to evaluate A transpose into A. A transpose will be equal to one two one three zero zero, and you have to multiply it with A which is equal to 1, 2, 1, 3, 0, 0. When you will uh, find the product of these two matrices, you are going to get 2, 5, 5, 13. This is actually A transpose into A. Okay? The next step is to find the inverse of A transpose A which is equal to a joint of a transpose of a 
into determinant of a transpose into a a joint is found by replacing the diagonal entries or by swapping the diagonal entries and by switching the signs of the off diagonal entries which is equal to 13 to minus 5 and then minus 5 while determinant is 13 to are 26 and 20, 5 into 5 25 which is 26 minus 25 so this is actually the inverse of a transpose into a okay the next step is to substitute the values over here and simplify further so let's just substitute the values 13 minus 5 minus 5 2 will be multiplied with a transpose which is equal to 1 2 1 3 0 0 and then you have to multiply it with b which is equal to 4 5 and 6 when you will simplify this matrix product you are going to get 2 and 1 so from here you can say that x1 is equal to 2 and x2 is equal to 1 let's just check either our solution is correct or not so what happens basically 1 time of x1 plus 2 times of x2 should result 4. So 1 time of x1 will be equal to 2 plus 2 times of x2 which is equal to 2 is equal to 4. So this is true. This is true in this case. Similarly the second equation is also satisfied since 2 plus 3 is equal to 5. But 0 times of 2 plus 0 times of 1 doesn't generate 6 so that's why this is called the approximated solution and this is our error since error is equal to b minus a x hat so b which is equal to 4 5 and 6 minus a x hat is actually equal to 4 5 and 0 so the error is equal to 0, 0 and 6 which is called the least square error. Thank you for watching.